Alrighty, today's kind of special because following our little excursion where we had that Lockwood pomegranate shrub, I think we both got inspired to make our own shrubs. Mm -hmm. So they're pretty simple. I just took and um, mashed up about a pound of strawberries and comboed it with an equal amount of sugar. The sugar pulls the juice out of the strawberries. Then I had a, a special pomegranate vinegar from a farm up in Sebastopol called Kozwalski Farms that was I've been holding on for a very special moment and yeah decided to throw it in there all your shrubs are going to have a vinegar in them that kind of counteract the incredible amounts of sugar as well and then you just let that sit for about a week and it absorbs all the flavor and the next day as i mentioned previously we had it with a watermelon agua fresca so strawberry watermelon yeah really nice combo we're going to mix this the pomegranate uh, strawberry shrub with uh, topo chico and i put a little bit of orange mango juice in here as well just to give it a little bit of a citrus note so i don't need too much this stuff is pretty intense vinegar and we use the topo mix spritz there you go. all right to yes. making our own shrubs. Yes, next time we'll try mine. <laughs> it's, that, well, it's that orange mango, but then it's like bitter. Yeah, it's all bit. kind of down at the bottom. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna... Give it a little stir. That is really tasty. Whoa. Mmm, we like. Right? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, with that vinegar. The balsamic is nice and sharp, but the sweetness from the mango and the orange juice just takes it down just a little bit. Mmm. I'm liking that. Delicious. So, right now, it's summer. You could do a shrub with any fruit you can get your hands on. Mm -hmm. Could be blueberries, peaches. Peach shrub would be probably pretty freaking amazing. I do have a lot of frozen peaches in my fridge mm. right now. That might be my second shrub. My first one was cherries, and I had I had frozen a bunch of cherries from when I went cherry picking earlier this year. So, yeah, maybe peaches will be next. We'll see. It is kind of a labor of love to make a shrub. Yeah. You need time and patience. <laughs> but it's... I really feel like it's precious. <laughs> it's just, I mean, I put so much work into this and it, it's really got a great flavor. I used my premium vinegar mm. that I had had for like five years. Now I'm gonna admit, I didn't use any premium <laughs> vinegars on mine. I used some straight table balsamic vinegar that you just get at the grocery store and some apple cider vinegar. That's it, so. <laughs> It will see how it turns out. But yeah, that, that balsamic that he used is very tasty. Now, it is interesting to note if you use a raspberry or pomegranate vinegar, it's going to bump up the flavor of whatever you um, make your shrub with. Mm -hmm. So those are particularly good to have on just even fresh fruit. So one of the things we were doing is just pouring this onto, just a little bit onto fresh peaches. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, really good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the the jalapeno. I did a orange jalapeno simple syrup for other cocktails, and so he's gonna doctor his his drink just, here just a little bit, just to try it. So it'll be interesting to see what the jalapeno does with the mango. You know, um, is there a way to get that jalapeno without the sweetness? Just get to the make jalapeno, a juice. jalapeno juice. Yeah. Sure, you can make a just, jalapeno juice. Um, what would be the best way to do that? Because I feel mm -hmm. like it would be nice to just you throw a, a juicer. Jalap <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, First, too, but, get a juicer. <laughs> <laughs> but like jalapeno and mango is a pretty good combo. Mm. All right. Well, let me know what you think of that. 
adding that in there. I like it. Yeah. Is it, too, is it too sweet though? Well, yeah, the sweetness is kind of the issue, but mm -hmm. I like a jalapeno mm -hmm. with strawberry. Water it down, dilute it a little bit more with the topo. Jalapeno, strawberry, jalapeno, mango. It's a good combo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And there's not a lot of heat in there, so mm -hmm. you don't have to worry about that. Yeah. But I like that. Do you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Drinkability. I will, I will add just a little bit and try it. Well, yeah, what's your drinkability scale on that one? At least seven and a half. Yeah? I mean, I want to be biased towards eight because it's my shrub, right. my precious shrub. It'll be my vote then. I don't know. It turned it more savory. Pre-jalapeno syrup, that was a solid eight for me. <laughs> That was really tasty. <laughs> well, hope you have fun making your own shrub. Yeah, we'll try it next time. All right.